up at my yeah. I'm the host of the most in this place. Good enough for 20, baby. I'm sitting here getting super blaze. And apparently, aliens are communicating with Donald Trump, baby. Out of all fucking numbskulls in the fucking universe, that's the motherfucker right there that they want to talk to, blood. <clears throat> So let's go ahead and analyze the situation. Players, you give me. Closing. Extraterrestrials. I'm Eshid. Aliens exist and President Trump knows about it. That's according to Israel's former space security chief. In an interview with an Israeli newspaper, he said the aliens have been waiting until today for humanity to develop and reach a stage where we will understand in general what space and spaceships are. NBC News chief global correspondent Bill Neely explains this one. Hi, Alice. So aliens. So this fucking lady said... The human race needs to reach a certain level so they understand what spaceships are. Got it. Well, this is quite a story, and it comes from the man who headed Israel's space security program for nearly 30 years. Chaim Eshed is making the extraordinary claim that the United States and Israel <coughs> have been in contact with a group of aliens for years. Not <coughs> immigrants. But extraterrestrials. He has this motherfucker. Tank with a group of aliens for years, not immigrants, but extraterrestrials. He has not immigrants who are not from your country, but extraterrestrials who are not from your planet. <laughs> oh my god. Them the Galactic Federation of Aliens, and he says President Trump is aware of the existence of these aliens and had been on the verge of revealing their secrets, he claims, but was asked not to do so by the Federation in order to prevent what he calls mass hysteria. If you on the verge of revealing their he has called them the Galactic Federation of Aliens, and he so. Let me get this fucking straight. So not only is Trump the second coming of Christ, like motherfucking Republicans, Christians say, but now scientists are coming out and saying that he also talks to fucking aliens, player, and he knows the <laughs> intergalactic fucking whatever the fuck, player. And all this just magically fucking happened when Donald Trump was is about to go maybe go to fucking jail for fucking overturning the government and doing all kinds of crazy shit. Uh, all of a sudden, Mr. Fucking Orange Fat Useless Fucking Golf Cart Rider talks to aliens and is the second coming of Christ player. Actually, that's how he got elected by a Republican Christian saying he's the second coming of Christ and shit. Okay. Um. Yeah. Uh, and apparently these aliens have been sharing technology with us. What technology? I don't know. The new iPhones came out. The new droids came out. Uh, what other kind of technology? Uh, I don't know. I guess they basically added upgrades to the fucking... All I see is upgrades to the technology we have. Nothing intergalactical fucking groundbreaking play. Uh... uh <clears throat> And this guy obviously didn't state that Joe Biden knows of this intergalactic fucking shit. Or maybe Joe Biden does, and so does Obama, and so does everybody else. Um, but why was Trump name revealed, and not all the other presidents? Makes no fucking sense. All I know is... If these aliens really talk to Donald Trump, can you imagine that fucking conversation? You know this dumb orange motherfucker would act exactly the same how he acts in front of us. You know, I'm like a really smart person. Sitting there pointing to his own fucking head, player. First of all, let me tell you guys that I'm like a really smart person. Points to his own fucking head, player. 
And then what else did Trump tell these fucking aliens? Be careful about windmills, man. They give you cancer. This town, the real, 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 that town will give you cancer. Is that what the smart motherfucker told him? Play the genius. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways, man. Every human has every right to believe whatever the fuck they want to believe, bro. If you believe Donald Trump is the second coming of Christ and talks to fucking aliens, by all means. But all I got to say to Trump and all his corporate parasite demon fleas and the extraterrestrial testicle motherfucker who's his homie and to Kim Jong Un who's homie and Donald Trump who's Trump's homie, fuck all you motherfuckers, you digs? And that's coming from a woke motherfucker from the left side, bro, who smokes a shit ton of weed. I know you guys are trying to criminalize it again and you guys want to legalize it because you guys are useless corporate parasite fucking demon slave motherfuckers, blood. You know motherfuckers out here still smoking and choking it up, please. Give me. Anyways, man. I miss the gun full time. <coughs> I'm gonna do smoke this fat ass blood, please. I'm <coughs> gonna <coughs> piss off a shit to the useless corporate demon parasite Republicans from the nine circle at AO play. All I got to say is stay woke out there, please, because these corporate demons are brain-dead, fucking parasitic, fucking useless slave player. Anyways, you got to stay high and fly, boy, and don't let the fucking goddamn Republican extraterrestrials come and get you, player. Hey, man, I got to... <laughs> A lot of Trump's crew, fool, if you talk to them, a lot of them say that aliens like to visit their bed at night, play up, and they like to do what they call a anal probe. Hey, look, man, I'm saying is you got a lot of people from Trump's community like, who always boy going on fucking YouTube and shit, be like, the goddamn alien man came in, take off my Budweiser sword and stuck his fucking, he held me down with like nine tentacles, man, put a fucking 12 foot fucking snake inside my ass and started crawling in my guts, man. I was like, wow, at least give me tap water first. Damn, I'm gonna serve the Patriot, Jesus. Can you at least put a ball in my mouth, a rubber one, damn. Let's put my gant mask on first. God damn. I was in a raped by an alien, not an illegal, but an extraterrestrial. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man, old Cleet is always beginning <laughs> tossed around by the fucking natives. Hey, those fucking traitors be going side to side out there in the middle of nowhere. Blood. That's what they be saying. <laughs> All <laughs> hey, all I gotta say is look it up, please. A lot of fucking stories coming out of the Trump community. That from them, he'll have eyes, fucking conservatives, play up for the fucking he'll have eyes community. You know the ones that be bumping that crazy fucking music when they be rolling up the vote player in the white van where they kidnapping motherfuckers. That old whoa, they stole our country. Whoa. With the fucking wobbly door that's always like this and shit, but when the fucking guy with the motor's on, player, you yeah, they have that fucking look, player, like, damn, if I was a teenage girl, they would be fucking kidnapping me right now. Yeah, yeah, take me back to their fucking farm and shit, like, I've never seen my family again. But yeah, man, we'll still have our Trump motherfuckers be coming up with some crazy UFO stories, player, about just fucking goddamn aliens be taking back transporters to the spaceship, putting on those fucking Cosmo candles, they be centered with some crazy shit from out of space. And let me tell you something, man, when that shit hits the conservative's nose, they just open up like a flower from the back, baby. Hey, a lot of conservatives and motherfuckers out there in the middle of nowhere, baby. Trump community, that hey. <clears throat> a lot of them say the aliens like to clean up after they're done at least, you know what I'm saying? They like, 
the real courtesy back there. But yeah, that's what a lot of them people say who get abducted. Any motherfucking way, I'm Mr. Governor 420. And I'm going to go uh, smoke this fucking weed and do some upgrades on the Jewish fucking space ladies that keep getting these fucking conservatives pregnant, man. <laughs> Bye-bye.